Hello everyone. Now we'll be starting with the exercise 16.3. In 16.3, we are going to discuss about the area of triangle. Till now, we have discussed the area of a parallelogram and area of rectangle and square. In 16.3, we will be doing area of triangle. So the area of triangle is half into base into height. If you will see this triangle, this is the base and on this base an altitude is formed. This is called as the height. So if you have to find the complete area of this triangle, the formula is half into base into height. On the basis of this formula, we are going to solve the questions. Okay. Now let us start with question number two. In question number two, find the area of these triangles. Now these triangles have been given and you have to find the area. For area of the triangle, I need base and height. Now in this first part, I am not having this height. I need to find this height and to find this height, I am going to use the Pythagoras theorem because this height is always making 90 degree angle with the base. Okay, so when 90 degree angle is formed, that means I'm going to use here the Pythagoras theorem. So let us start with this. In this, firstly, I'm going to use the Pythagoras theorem. What is Pythagoras theorem? Hypotenuse square is equals to perpendicular square plus base square. What is hypotenuse? 5 square. AB you have to find. So AB square as it is. BC is the base which is 4 square. 5 square 25. AB square as it is 4 square is 16. It will go to the other side. 9 will come and 9 is the square of 3. So 3 square equals to AB square. The value of this AB will come 3 centimeters. Now to find the area of triangle, I am having base, I am having height. So what will be the area of triangle half into base into height? If you will see in this, what is the base? 4. What is the height? 3. So half into base is 4, height is 3. Cancel 2 ones are 2 twos are. What is 2 threes are 6. So the answer of this is 6 centimeters square. Okay, so the area of this complete, this area complete is going to be 6 centimeters square. Let us do B part of this. Now this triangle is already given to you. In this sides are given to you. And this height is given to you. This height is given which is 5 centimeters. And this height is making an angle of 90 degree along with this base. So what will be the area of triangle? In this height is already given. So half into base into height. Half into what is the base? 6 centimeters. What is the height? 5. 2 1s are 2 3s are. What is 3 5s are? 15. So the answer is 15 centimeters square. Now let us do C part. In the C part, I have been given this AB which is the height 9 centimeters. Hypotenuse I have been given which is 25 centimeters but I don't know what is the base. And to find the area of triangle, I need the base. So to find this base, I am going to apply Pythagoras theorem. What is Pythagoras theorem? Hypotenuse square equals to Perpendicular square plus base square. Hypotenuse is 25. So this will be 25 square. Height is how much? 9 square. So this will go to the other side. It will become 81. Solve this. You will be getting BC square 544. Now I have explained you already how to find the square root. You are going to factorize 544. When you are going to factorize. The numbers which are making a pair like this 2 is making a pair. Bring it outside. Write it like this. This 2 is making a pair. Write it like this. And the numbers which are not forming the pair 2 and 17. Bring them in the under root. So this will become 2 to the 4 and 17 to the 34. So the value of the base will be how much? 4 root 34. Now I have got the base. Now what will be the area of triangle? Half into base into height. Half. What is the value of base? You have just found out. 4 root 34 into, into 9. So 2 1s are 2 twos are. What is 2 9s are? 18. So the answer is 18 root 34. Right? Now let us do question number 3. You have to find the base in which area is given and height is given. You have to find the value of the base. Now, what is the area of triangle? Half into base into height. What is the area? 127.5 half into what is the base? You need to find it. And what is the height? Already 17 given to us. 
बेस विल रिमेन हेयर ओनली दिस टू विल गो अप एंड दिस सेवनटीन विल कम डाउन यू विल कैंसल इट यू विल बी गेटिंग द आंसर फिफ्टीन मीटर्स ओके यू नीड टू कैंसल ऑल दीज एंड यू विल बी गेटिंग फिफ्टीन मीटर्स लेट एस डू बी पार्ट The B part is area is given, height is given. You have to find the base of the triangle. Area of the triangle is equals to half into base into height. Area is given three four two zero right here as it is half into base. What is the base? We need to find and what is the height? Fifty seven. So now what you will be doing is two will go to the other side and fifty seven will come down. This base we need to find, so that's why it is going to remain here as it is. Fifty seven ones are, and when you will cancel it, it will go on fifty seven on sixty. So the answer will be one twenty centimeters. Base is one twenty centimeters. Similarly, in question number four, you need to find the height in which area and base is given to you. Area of triangle is half into base into height. What is area of triangle? One two three five. Half into base. What is the base? Forty seven point five into height. You need to find the height. So what you will do? Two we will make it up, and this forty seven point five will come down. Solve it, and you will be getting the height. Okay, the answer will be fifty two centimeters. Next, B part. B part is. Area is seven twenty nine centimeters square given. Base is given forty point five. You need to find the height. Same concept. You just need to apply the values. Area of triangle is seven twenty nine. Half into base. What is the base? Forty point five. You need to find the height. Two will go up. Forty point five will come down. Now see, I have explained you this earlier also. When decimal is in the denominator, to remove the decimal, we are going to multiply with ten in the numerator. Okay, so I have multiplied by ten in the numerator. Cancel it. You will be getting thirty six centimeters as the height. Right. Now let us move to question number five. Question number five is a triangular garden has the base thirty meters and height thirty two meters. So the height and the base is thirty meters and thirty two meters. You have to find the cost of leveling the garden at rupees six per meter square. So you what you have to do is in this. You have to level it. This complete area you have to level it. So firstly, you are going to find the area of this triangle. What is the area of triangle? Half into base into height. Base is thirty. Height is thirty-two. You will be cancelling it. You will get four hundred and eighty meters square. If I am going to level this much part, which is one meter square, this much part I have to level. That means only six rupees I have to give. But if I have to level this complete triangle, this complete area, which is of four eighty meters square, then I am going to multiply this four eighty by six. I will be getting two thousand eight hundred and eighty rupees. Complete this exercise till question number five. Thank you.